everybody. On this video, I've got a uh, just a quick set doorknob here that I don't have a key for it. Uh, what I want to do is actually rekey it and uh, stick on the closet. So, get here first, gonna uh, disassemble it. Tap it on something a little harder than my rubber mat. There we go. So there's our cylinder out. And I'm going to pop the clip off before I pick it here. So it doesn't turn and get in the way of the bees getting in the way of trying to pop it off if you uh, pick it first or trying to. Uh, Kind of push it off, you can actually wind up you know, like saying, locking it back. But when you do take it off all the way, you need to be careful though, because when you pull the pick out, you can actually uh, pull the cylinder out and dump all your drivers, which is not what I want to do. I'm going to go to uh, one here, two, three, four. Pulling the whole plug out on accident though, doing this is more likely to happen when you're uh, raking instead of single pin picking. Alright, so we got it open. And dump all the pins out here. And here's the key that I'm going to be raking to. There's a bidding on it. Uh, four, five, two, five, four. And we're gonna get the pins out off camera over here. And of course, when you're loading pins, you just want to make sure they're all flush with the shear line. Functions good. And of course, you do not want to forget to put the uh, clip back on. And my door is going to be like this, where it's going to be closing and pushing into this. So, the cylinder is going to be so it's going to be going in this direction. And so I like my cylinder to be right side up. I need to put it in this way, which is actually the opposite of what it was. Clipped in, put our spindle back in, and then we're ready to go uh, throw it back on the door. Or throw it on the door, I guess it wasn't on the door to start with. So, anyway, that'll uh, do it for this video, and I uh, will talk to everybody later.